It's the first major flooding incident in the Pinal de Bay region for the year following thunderstorms last night. Flooded is a large section of the Pinal Rock Road and nearby communities, something which isn't a new occurrence. The floods are emanating from the hills, of course, the southern range, which is only a mile away from where we are. This is the area that it will customarily flood first. He says the area typically floods twice annually due to drainage issues out of the corporation's hands. And unfortunately for residents, Dr. Sami believes the situation would worsen as high tide rolls in. Now, the flooding incident that we saw here today was not the largest that has ever hit the Pinal de Bay Regional Corporation. But for those affected and the residents around, it's very real. Mulchant Trace resident for 30 years, Curtis Kalipasad, was one of those residents. Luckily, well, we were able to move out everything, lift everything higher, and, well, no, nothing was damaged, and it's just the clean-up now. 76-year-old Sam de Motilal was also affected, and while losses were minimal on the ground floor of her house, the heavy downpour made her lose her peace of mind. And I always say, God, forgive me, God, forgive me. Take care of me, God. I pray to God. All the time I live praying to God, to beg God to forgive me. Dr. Sami says the PDRC's disaster management unit was placed on alert last night and continued to be on standby to provide any necessary assistance. Rashad Khan, CNC3 News, Pinal.